Right, a quick update from the sports desk now. We are talking about one of the two most important events, I think, happening for South Africans this weekend. The 2022-23 Premier Soccer League season is coming to an end tonight with the Netman Cup drawing the curtains. Pirates are looking to become the most successful club in this campaign, and that's by winning two of the three available trophies. The team from Orlando have already scooped the MTN8 for 2022-23 and are now chasing the only other cup title on offer. Meanwhile, Sikukuna United, who are, they are facing, of course, in this final Pirates, have already made history by reaching not just the semi-finals, but the final for the very first time. And they are now looking for their maiden top flight crown. To help us preview the final, we do have a Buccaneers legend, Ndademax Maponyane, Go Man Go, as he was affectionately known in his playing days. A very good morning to you, legend. Thank you so much for joining us uh, this morning. Ndadi, there are two, three trophies on offer. Two of them are already gone, one of them being the league that I think all 16 teams uh, usually chase, um, at least if they think they can. Then there was the MTN8. Pirates have already dealt with that one, beating Mamelodi Sundowns, in fact, to that title. Now we've got the Netbank Cup. Pirates have an opportunity. They have a coach who is in his first season looking to show that he, in fact, is not somebody to be disrespected. There was a question I think one of the journalists asked at the beginning of the season when Jose Rivero was revealed as the head coach. He was saying, there are people that are calling you a plumber. What do you say to that question? So he's now proven that he's somebody that actually does know how to win cup titles. Legend, I'm going to ask you, can Pirates do it? Can Jose, Jose Rivero do it? Good morning, Moran, and uh, good morning to the viewers. Yes, uh, Pirates can do it. Pirates have the players that are capable of uh, going out there and uh, set, the, uh, set the stage alive. We saw them uh, scoring not one, not two, but four last weekend. And uh, it just shows you that there is capability. But the only thing that I always uh, worry about is consistency. And when it comes to cup finals, and I'm sure a lot of uh, former players can testify to this, all the great semi-final performance goes out of the window. I don't know whether it's tension or just that uh, wish not to put the foot wrong. And I wish no player, by the way, in uh, on both sides, not to have that misfortune of scoring an own goal that we saw from Mbala that uh, made a big, big decision, not only for Sundowns, but for South Africa. So those are the things that players don't want when it comes to a final. Neither of the Pirates nor Skukuni players should do that. Let it be a game where they express themselves. Pirates, yes, can do it. They have the ability. Four points have been taken from Orlando Pirates by Sukukuna United this season. There was a win and there was a draw. So, essentially, in this particular campaign, Pirates don't know how to beat Sukukuna United. What does Sukukuna do differently, if anything, to ensure that it's three times that Pirates don't defeat them? What Sukukuna should not do is to try something different that will cost them. They just need to do what they've been doing well, which is A, respecting, but also not uh, fearing Orlando Pirates, because that's what they did. I mean, you can recall the one or draw at Orlando. I mean, in Pirates' backyard, they went out there and uh, put their foot down and stamped their authority. And that's what you need to do. Don't even say we played Pirates. Don't even say, who are we? We are Skukuni. Pirates finished second. We have only finished seventh. Those are just numbers. Those are facts. But what is more important on the day will be the guards, the belief, and uh, the lack of fear on the day. So All of what the they should do, by the way, sorry, I was just trying to say what they should not do differently is to try to be smart. You know, that's the worst thing that can happen to anything and coach or to any team. And coaches will tell you, don't try to be smart. Keep it straight and simple. Do what you do best. Do what you can do not what you wish to do. Rema Ponyane, they say, don't fix it if it's not broken. So that's essentially what the advice is uh, coming from you. But mine was going to be, my next question that is, was it, you would know better than anybody that in a football match, particularly in a cup final, it takes a moment of brilliance. And that moment of brilliance will come from one particular player. In the MTN8, it came from Munna Pule Saleng against Amazulu, 
where he hit that beautiful free kick uh, past Veli Mortua to essentially win the title for Pirates. Will it come to that in this particular final? Is it going to be a matter of a moment of brilliance or a team effort? It will be a moment of brilliance. Cup finals are like that. They've got this tendency of uh, needing a hero. As uh, you always hear commentators would say, this game is so tense and uh, it is so tactical. It just needs a hero. And uh, it will come to where the game needs a hero. And I hear you mention Salem, but you also have to remember that you've got the uh, most missing song of Villagazi. I mean, Villagazi is experienced, he's confident, he can pop from nowhere, he's a clever player. So, on the other side, meaning on the Scoopini side, that can be the brilliant player. Cup finals are always summed up by saying it needs two things. First, it needs a moment of brilliance and it needs a moment of just misfortune. How many teams and players look uh, looks back at uh, the past and say, mm. ah, we could have won that game, something silly happened. And that's cup finals for you. But I hope nobody gets that silly moment. Let that be a brilliant moment than a silly moment. Most definitely. Rema Ponyani, just in a couple of seconds, Kitlo Kupa score, Kikupa prediction. I'd like to put your head on the block. Who will be crowned the 2022-23 NetBank Cup champion? I want to always be different because I believe, and once I start believing in something, I always put my money in it. I will surprise everyone or uh, all on Sunday by saying, uh, I will think that uh, Skukuni has surprise package uh, for us. And I'll tell you why, because Pirates players will be thinking, we are the ones, we are favorites. Beware of favorites, because you can be favored, but you need to favor yourself by, or do yourself a favor by doing all the best that is expected of you. But that can always be a problem. Complacency, one word for that, can Most always definitely. let you down. Most definitely. Rema Ponyane, as always, it is such a pleasure speaking to you. Thank you so much for joining us here on ENCA this morning to talk the NetBank Cup. Have yourself an amazing Saturday. That is Orlando Pirates legend, Go Man Go, Max Maponyane, just talking to us about the NetBank Cup final. It is kicking off at 6 o'clock this evening. Of course, it is kicking off about the same time as the United Rugby Championship final. So if you have nothing to do this weekend and you are a lover of sport, guys, URC final, NetBank Cup final, you are spoiled for choice.